Good morning, gang, 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 gang. <laughs> Happy Tuesday. So, y'all, I know y'all probably are wondering, like, what in the world, Danny? Y'all, it is 5 a.m., and I am currently on my way to the voting site. So, I typically would vote somewhere else, but since this is other voting, I got to drive, like, 20 minutes from my grandma's house, which works out perfect because she is actually closer um, than I would have been going. So, yeah, y'all, it's 5 a.m. I don't have any coffee or anything, so I'm low-key suffering. But it's 5 o'clock and the voting poll opens at 7. So I'm going extremely early just to make sure that I get in line and I'm able to vote and I make sure that I secure my vote. That way um, when I go to the dentist, I'll already be devoted and then I can either just get on the road or, you know, do what I would do so. Oh, pardon me. But yeah, guys, good morning. Happy Tuesday. Um, hopefully, you guys are having a good day whenever you're watching this. We are on day 20 of Vlogtober. Y'all, I can't believe we're, we've made it. Like, we're making it. So, hopefully, you got, hopefully this gets you guys pumped for Vlogmas because I will be doing Vlogmas. Um, but anyway, good morning, good morning, good morning. Uh, it's too dark for you guys to see me. But I need you guys to know that I'm accepting the members of the Danny Gang. So if you want to be a member of the Gang 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 because your keto low carb like books, I just want to support me. Then like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, and put your fists up. Once you put your fists up and you fight me and you're jumped in, and only then are you a lifetime member. Period. So yeah, y'all, we're just about to keep on driving. Like I said, I was going to come and get my boat in read. Regardless, it is something that is super important. So you guys still have time to early vote. Um, we can get prepared for November third voting. If you need an absentee ballot or whatever, get it done. It's our right, and I feel like all our people, our ancestors, everybody fought for us to be able to vote. So go freaking vote. Go get your sticker. Go post it, boo. Like, go freaking vote. <laughs> If you're just doing it for to to, to post, because you know every, nowadays everything about posting. If you didn't post it, it didn't happen. So if you're doing it just to post, go do that. But I vote every single year. I voted for Obama both times, and I've been voting ever since. So that's my little spiel. Shout out to y'all that was commending me on voting. Like that was one of the reasons I came back to vote. But anyway, y'all, let's get on this road. Um, got about maybe 15 minutes left. So, I will just see you guys at the voting, voting polls. Not in the voting poll. I want to get in trouble. I'll see you guys outside in line <laughs> at the voting poll. All right, see you guys later. Hey, guys. So, I'm done voting. Give me one second because I just ordered an iced coffee from mcdonald's excuse me sn87 i just ordered um a large iced um sugar-free vanilla coffee with three espresso shots and um caramel syrup I think I got a large. I don't know why I got a large. But anyway, y'all. So, yeah, y'all officially see my face. Good morning, y'all. I feel so good. I'm so happy. Your girl is a voter. Uh, so, um, I'm a Georgia voter. I secured my votes. Um, so, I'm really happy about that. So now I'm right by this McDonald's. So I didn't get coffee this morning. Like I got up, tried to do like a quick little workout because I didn't work out yesterday and I didn't want to miss like two days working out. So I did a quick little workout and then I just went to vote. So I didn't have time to like do coffee or anything. So I'm about to grab a coffee. And since it's so early, I'm going to go back to granny house and just chill with her. And then I'll probably head to my orthodontist appointment around 10 because it's at 11 so i'll probably leave her house at 10 i just i don't know i think i need to eat i think i need to eat because once i get my braces tightened i don't know if it's gonna be painful or what so i'm just a little bit worried because i i really want to eat after i get my braces tightened so that i can just get on the road 
so I may just thug it out. I may just um, drink my coffee and chill, then go get my braces tightened at 11 and then eat, get on the road. I'm gonna take some ibuprofen though. Hello? I wanted hot coffee so bad, y'all, but whenever I get hot coffee from McDonald's, it literally has to have like 15 sugars. <laughs> Babe gets it so good, but. But anyway, I'm a voter, I'm getting coffee. I'm so happy I wore this little sweatshirt today because I had to stand outside for over an hour, but luckily, um, I voted and everything within 20 minutes. Welcome to Atlanta. <laughs> that was rude, I'm sorry. Hey, is anybody here? Do I need to go to the next window? Really? I'll be back, y'all. Child, just when everything was going dandy, um, I had to just pull up to the window because nobody ever came to the voice box. And she was like, oh, well, we're changing switch shifts, so nobody's going to be at the voice box. That's not business savvy. But anyway, hopefully my drink is right. I ordered, um, y'all already know, an iced, um, sugar-free vanilla iced coffee with three espresso shots and uh, carbon syrup. So, let's see. Uh, I actually want to lay back down, y'all. Like, I literally want to lay back down, which I probably will. It's 741, so I'm just about to go back to Granny House and chill. Child, they gave me a large. I think I ordered a medium. So that's usually what I order. So y'all already know I'm finna taste it right now. Cause I ain't no shame in my game. If it ain't good, it's going bad. I'm never gonna be able to drink all this. Oh, it's good. <laughs> oh, it's really good. If he can go, I can go. Do that? Do y'all do that too? Do y'all ever be like side by side with another car and be like, well, if they go, I know I can go. I do that all the time. I use other people all the time to like help me drive. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah, this is blessing. Absolutely not gonna be able to drink it all, but it's really, really, really good. So yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just eat after. I get my braces tightened and hopefully it won't be too bad. I'll just have to, I really want a Chick-fil-A because I don't know how my braces are going to be. Like, I don't know if my braces are going to hurt. So I wanted to eat Chick-fil-A, but I'm just going to wait till after my appointment and hopefully they don't hurt like right after so I can eat. And then, um, yeah, but I'm going to pop like four ibuprofen before I go. But yeah, y'all. My voting experience was lit. Um, I voted. It was quick and easy. I waited in line like an hour. And they're open from 7 to 7. So I really could have went anytime. But I wanted to make sure I was in and out. Um, because like I said, where I go get my braces done and all my dinner work is like an hour from where my grandma lives now. So I didn't want to go vote at like 9 and then be, you know, in jeopardy of being in line for <clears throat> two hours because I was already in line for over an hour. So I just, the early bird gets the worm. So I just got up and did it and I'm so excited. I'm so happy. Y'all, this hair, y'all probably be seeing me in videos. I be pulling off hair because one thing about these butterfly locks is they're really cute. I love them. They're easy, but they get tangled. And that hair that gets tangled, as you're detangling it, you just have to pull it off. So 
yeah um but anyway y'all we're headed back to my grandma's house i'm about to chill with her i know she would love that uh when i pop up um i'm gonna just pop up with my sticker like bam because she was like just send me a picture if you don't come back granny i'm coming back and i think i'm gonna go get her flowers because i did not go get her flowers yesterday so if i pass a kroger i'll pop in kroger and grab her some flowers uh, because she would really like that and i got two stickers so i got her a sticker because you know she older so i don't believe she stood in line and voted i think she did an absentee vote so she don't got a sticker so i grabbed her a sticker but anyway y'all i'm about to sip my coffee head back to my grandma high. hopefully i find a kroger me and y'all can go get her some flowers and then we're gonna chill until our orthodontist appointment y'all i'm really nervous about my orthodontist appointment because i broke a bracket i don't even think i ever told y'all but i broke a bracket a couple weeks ago and I end up going to my new orthodontist in North Carolina. They couldn't replace my bracket because I wasn't like a patient patient yet. I don't become a patient until right before Halloween. But I broke a bracket and the wire was literally sticking me to death. Like I was bleeding profusely. Okay, I'm exaggerating. But I was getting poked. So I had went and made an appointment with my new orthodontist to snip that wire. And so yeah, I'm nervous because I think you got like five um, times that you can break a bracket and then you gotta start paying. So sister already broke one bracket. <laughs> so I'm nervous about what they gonna say. But mm, y'all see all these, them cars going that way? Maybe these folk going to work. Y'all better stop playing with them. What is this? What is this little shopping center? I'm looking for a Kroger. This looked like a Kroger shopping center, but it wasn't. This is so good. Mm. My mama said that they don't have the sugar-free uh, French vanilla coffees in... Um, Louisiana no more. I'm so sad because obviously they here in Atlanta and they also in North Carolina. So I did try to use my coupon for um, coffee for a dollar, but they end up charging me like a couple dollars because I added three espresso shots and I added some caramel syrup. So I guess once you add that type of stuff, it kind of canceled out. But anyway, at this point, I'm rambling. So let me find a Kroger so that I can go get some granny some flowers. And then we're going to head to her house. It's about to be 8 o'clock. So I'm really just going to go to her house for like an hour, which is cool. Y'all see the sun up? But anyway, I'll um yeah, I'll see y'all in the next clip. So yeah, if y'all know anything about me, y'all know every time I come see my grandma, I get her flowers. I went with kind of like a fall arrangement. But yeah, yesterday I was just tired, but y'all know I had to get my girl some flowers. And she was looking for them yesterday too, so I always go to Kroger. And this is what they look like. Yes. Okay guys, so I just um, pulled up to the orthodontist. I got like 20 minutes until my appointment. I just had some Chick-fil-A because I was watching like some videos and Ooh, excuse me. I was watching some. I look rough, y'all. I'm going to bounce back, though, this week. I promise. <laughs> but I was watching some videos, and everybody who was going to get their braces tightened kept saying, eat a big meal. Eat a big meal before you get your braces tightened. Eat a big meal before you get your braces tightened. So that's exactly what I did. I got 20 minutes, so I'm about to just, like, clean my car <clears throat> and make my car comfortable because as soon as I get back, well, as soon as I get out of my orthodontist appointment i am gonna hit the road and head back to north carolina yeah i'm just gonna like put some stuff in the trunk clean out my front seat brush my teeth because i just ate chick-fil-a and then i'm gonna go inside my appointment and then we're gonna get on the road so i just wanted to come give you guys an update i kind of um am just coming back now because y'all i was busy the chick-fil-a line was long so now we're out and like I said, let me um, go ahead and clean my car, make it comfortable, and then oh, I'm on the phone. Um, I'm gonna uh, clean my car, make it comfortable, child. You know you in Atlanta when people be trying to get y'all your information. But anyway, I'm gonna clean the car. Well, now I don't want to since he's waiting for me to get out. So 
So yeah, clean my car and organize it, brush my teeth, and then I'll see you guys inside. Now All right, gang, so I'm literally already done with my appointment and it's only 11.30, which is awesome because now I can just go fill my tank up and then I can get on the road. If I'm on the road by 12, I should be home by like 4.35, which is really good timing. Um, so basically what they told me was not the next time I won't get my bottoms on, but the next time after that, I probably can. And they were just saying, because my top needs more time, my top teeth are like a little bit smaller than my bottom. So we just need more time. And then he said, also, um, the next time I come, they're gonna move some brackets around and then the bracket that I popped, they're gonna put it back on and give me a thicker wire. So the next time I come, I'm gonna have to be on a liquid diet for three hours after my appointment and then soft foods for three days. Kind of like the same when I got them put on initially, which kind of sucks. But um, this process literally was like 10 minutes cause my appointment was at 11.20 and um, it's now 11.32. So, um, it really was a quick appointment which i'm happy about and now i already feel pain on the, my right side at the top well my braces at the top but i already feel pain on my right side i don't have any wires poking which is awesome so that's good and i already took four ibuprofen so that's good so all in all i'm so so happy i was able to get my teeth cleaned as well as a fluoride treatment i was able to vote and i was able to get my braces my braces tightened and uh all of that so i pretty much had a successful trip i'm trying to think is there anything i need to do in atlanta i don't think so um now now i just have to see what i want to do so my orthodontist here he stated that he wanted me to come back um, at the, the first week in December to do the moving around, which I can. Or, like I said, I already have an orthodontist um, in North Carolina, so I'm still gonna go to my orthodontist appointment in North Carolina and just see like what, what treatment she says and all of that. But y'all, I can already tell my feet, my teeth are going to be killing me. So um, I'm about to stop, fill my tank up, and then um, probably get like some water. I'm trying to think, am I gonna need anything as I'm driving home? Because I don't know if I'm gonna be in pain by the time I get there. That's kind of why I don't want to hang around. I kind of want to get on the road and go just so that way I can hurry up and get back to, 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 the, to home so that if I am in pain, I can just lay down and yeah, I already did my workout, so I'm good. So yeah, good trip. Y'all not gonna be able to tell no difference, but I got gray again and they just put a thicker wire on and I guess each time you get your braces, your braces, your braces tighten, you get a thicker wire, so. I'm um, excited, so yes, yes, yes. Um, what else I wanna tell you guys? But yeah, it was quick, easy, it was efficient. She asked me my color, um, she took the wire out. But anyway, y'all, um, if something pop off, I'll bring y'all back out. If not, I'll probably see you guys when I get back home, and then I'll probably end the vlog because, um, Yeah, it's gonna be late and I ain't gonna do nothing. The only thing I might do when I get home is take these butterfly locks out. But anyway, y'all, yeah, I'll see you guys when I get where I'm going or back to North Carolina. Um, may the angels go before me. And yeah, I need to text some granny and then let them know I'm headed back. So I'll see you guys later.